Right, so I've got some hawks to do. These are uh, off a ZXR 400, 1989. So I've got to <coughs> strip the uh, chrome part so that they can get re-chrome because they're all pretty rough. And um, I think the guy's going to get these re-anodized. I think the coating is Kashima. Might be wrong. So I'm going to go through stripping these down. Got a massive uh, top cap on this. It's uh, 41. Take the tops off. A little help with this tool. Um, yeah, so just need to tighten that down now. That's enough. Spanning. Not that one, it's the top one. It's any me. Okay, how tight are you going to be? It's not too bad. Right, before I go anywhere, I'm just going to. Um, I'm just going to see where the uh, rebound set. Yeah, sorry about the sun glare. So, tops off. Um, it was four out the adjuster. Um, I think that's quite a large. I don't know if it's a 10. It's a 10, so. Oh, he said he, it was loose. He didn't actually loose it. So they should get it off. Get the bloody driving. I'm struggling to hold the bottom. Seal out of the way, get the spring clip away, just pull these out of the way. <coughs> That's that one done. The other one out. Oops, sorry. Let's pull that one done. So, don't stab yourself. Right, now I'm not sure how these caught apart yet, so. I'm struggling to get <laughs> a good angle with the camera. So, everything goes in this bucket down on the floor. Um, yeah, so some forks, is that in shot? Some forks, you can pull these off and there's nothing to stop them. Um, 
Alright, so let's find out. Now, I must remember to look at the camera. So this one, yeah, we've got to pull the bushings off. Oh, sorry. So I'll do that off camera because I couldn't possibly do it. <laughs> so there's the spilling fork coin everywhere. So that's the, the outer off. <coughs> do the other side. Try and do it in, in, in camera. Might be a bit boring, so feel free to skip ahead. Just washing the inside of the fork out. It's just bread cleaner. Right, so I've got it mounted in some wooden jaws and uh, we've got a, a hole that passes through both sides um, so we're going to have to find something to fit through there um, to basically unthread this from the bottom so I'm not really going to be able to film this very well because I've got to heat up this end and then all the action's going to be at the other end, me turning it. Made a little handle. It's um, M6 stud, um, a couple of nuts tightened down, and then I've just got a bit of aluminium tubing to hold on to. I've just removed the grub screw. Quite important to remove that. Um, and I've put on some uh, Sharpie ink. Um, I don't know if it's true, but I, I watched a video a long time ago and it said that Sharpie melts, uh, disappears at like 500 degrees or something. So it's, quite a good, <clears throat> it's quite a good indicator. Anyway, we'll uh, get this bottom warmed up. So the paint started bubbling up but the sharpie mark hasn't moved. Oh bloody hell. <laughs> wow, that just that wasn't even tight. Wow. Wow, that's amazing. 
came out so easily. Yeah. Very good. Well, I'll get the next one up. Right, so I've got the second one ready to go. I haven't warmed it up yet. Just out of curiosity, I'm just going to see if it'll unscrew. No, it won't. So it's not loose. <laughs> In case you're wondering, um, the Sharpie mark didn't. Uh, nothing happened to it. I don't know. This is almost too hot to touch, but the Sharpie marks didn't come off. Uh, these are going to get uh, re redone, so you can't really do this without damaging the original paint. And the original paint on that one started to bubble up just a little bit, but you might you might get away with just a heat gun on some of them. See how this one goes. Oh, yeah, it's going. It's a little bit harder than the other one. This one definitely feels a bit. Yeah, it's going now. I think the guy's imported this, or it's been imported recently. So this, this area here is probably the worst place because all the, you know, like if you ride in the winter, all the salt and the grit can get down in there off the roads. So probably not doing this very much just justice, but that's pretty rusty, but still come out. 